Lexus KE7 TRP. This video is just showing you how uh, I have two receivers hooked up to the same antenna at the same time. Right now I have the ICOM on uh, 80 meters, the SDR radio on the same antenna on 80 meters, they're on the same frequency. They have similar performance. But there they are. There's a slight delay on the SDR. Behind the ICOM is a coaxial relay, 12 volts. That switches over to a uh, this box that's sitting up there temporarily. That is a uh, receive galvanic uh, isolator. And it's got a protection circuit and a padding circuit in there. So when I key up the ICOM, the antenna is switched to the ICOM's coax, uh, you know, antenna. The two receivers split by this mini circuits coupler here are protected by that box there. The relay takes it over to a resistor and there's also diodes and a, uh, and a lamp in there. This way if something goes wrong and you uh, your relay doesn't switch or the timing isn't right, so on and so forth, it, uh, it won't blow out the SDR and it won't blow out the front end of the any other receiver that you have hooked up in line. Um, what's neat about this is, uh, here's a good example. You, you maybe you can hear the, uh, the heterodyne. I'll turn the ICOM down. The audio's poor on the laptop, but it just stopped. There was the uh, heterodyne right there in the waterfall. Um, you can hit the notch and then notch that uh, heterodyne out. If you don't want to use the SDR, you just mute, turn the ICOM up, everything works as normal. If you key up the uh, ICOM right now and, and uh, speak into the microphone, uh, there's a, about an 80 dB attenuator that, uh, that goes in line to the SDR receivers. And then that way you have a band scope, a calibrated band scope. You can also put the SDR in any other uh, band or frequency right now, independent of the ICOM, at the same time. If you reach over and just start talking on the ICOM, it's just going to uh, to mute and protect the SDR. So, anyways, I thought you guys would uh, like to see a video of how we uh, we got all this hooked up. Uh, thanks a lot to Robert for helping me on this project. It was pretty uh, uh, pretty complex getting everything to work right. Hope you guys liked the video.